Hi, in today's video, I'm going to be having a look at CSV Kit, which is a command line application for manipulating CSV data. With it, we can convert Excel spreadsheets into CSV. We can pull out particular columns from the CSV file, and reorder them, and we can also do things like join CSV files together. So those are some of the things that we're going to be covering. So first of all, what we need to do is actually install CSV Kit. And you'll find it in your um, package manager um, repository. So if I run apt search CSV kit, uh, you can see that it's already installed. And I did that by running sudo apt install CSV kit. Uh, you can also install this with um, Python and uh, with pip um, Python. Um, but the easiest way to do this is um, use your package manager. So now that we've actually got this installed, what we're going to do is use it to convert a Excel spreadsheet into a CSV file. So I have a um, Excel spreadsheet here of five of the worst films ever made, um, in my opinion. And what I'm going to do is use that as a demo um, to um, convert that Excel spreadsheet into a CSV file, reorder the columns and join them up again. So first of all, what we're going to do is we'll run CSV look. Worst, uh, first, first thing we need to do is actually convert the file into a CSV file. So the way we do that is running the into CSV command. The name of the file we want to convert. And we're going to redirect that out into a new file with a CSV extension. So we now have two files, the original Excel file and the new CSV file. So what we can do is we can use several commands to actually look at this data. So first of all, we can run CSV look. And this will actually print out the spreadsheet so you can see here we've got title year and reason and basically this is a list of the five worst films um and the year and the reason for them so at the top here we've got pulp fiction and reason for this being the worst film ever made is bruce willis's acting in the car scene uh, following that we've got reservoir dogs another quentin tarantino movie and the reason for the uh, ranking is because Quentin, T um, Quentin Tarantino's acting and the calf scene talking about Madonna. Uh, the next film we've got is Eye of the Tiger, which is a 1986 movie uh, with Gary Boosie, um, whose acting is so wood in, uh, surprising no one called Rent a Kill, and also the lack of a believable plot. Uh, following that, we've got Greystoke, which is a 1984 film based on Tarzan. And Andy McDowell's acting was so bad, they actually had to get Glenn Close to redub her all her lines. And Andy McDowell didn't actually find out till she went to the premiere and found out someone was redubbed all the lines. Uh, the next film um, in the list is Superman 4, uh, The Quest for Peace, um, which was released in 1987, which is um, widely regarded to have some of the worst special effects ever in a movie. So what we're going to do now after um, looking at that is actually use another command called csv cut with the dash n option and the name of the file and what that's going to do is actually print out the um, the column names in the csv file so we've got title year and reason and what we can now do is um, use the csv cut command with the dash c option to pull out um, particular um, columns and um, save them into a new file. So if I want to reorder these columns, um, what I can do is CSV cut dash C. And suppose I want to um, reorder these columns the other way around, three, two, one. So I can go three, comma, two, comma, one. Worst films ever made, CSV. And we'll put that as out.csv. And if I have a look at that file now, csv cut n out, you'll see this has been reordered. So we've got the reason, the year, and the title. 
and use the CSV look command. And you'll see this is uh, reordered the actual data in the um, sheet. So what I'm going to do now is uh, I'll just remove that. What I'm going to do now is um, extract um, a couple of columns uh, into two separate spreadsheets and then rejoin them. So I'm going to um, again CSV cut, CSV cut, uh, CSV cut with the dash n option, and that's going to show me the columns. So what I want to do is actually separate this out into two files one containing the title and year and the uh, second file will contain the reason for, for the film being ranked so low uh, th then what i'm going to do is i'm going to take those two files and rejoin them again so csv cut the dash c option the um you can either use the number here or you can actually you can actually type title and year but it's easier to just type out the number I'm going to type out one, two, um, worst films ever made, and I'm going to call this um, sheet one, sheet one dot CSV. Uh, what you need to do is redirect the output, sheet one dot CSV. And if I have a look at that, CSV cut with the dash N option, you'll see it just has the title and year. What I'm going to do next is um, extract the reason column into um, sheet two, and then I'll show you how we can rejoin those files. So CSV cut the dash C option. I want the third column um, from the worst films ever made CSV file. And I'm going to redirect that, redirect that out into sheet two dot CSV. So, uh, what I'll do is I'll just remove the Excel spreadsheet and you can see here we've got the worst films ever made and sheet one and sheet two and if I look at use the CSV look command on sheet two uh, you'll just see here it's got the reason uh, whereas sheet one has got the title and year so what I want to do is combine sheet one and sheet two uh, into a new file and that's easily done using the CSV SV join command. And what we do is we simply give it sheet one, sheet two, and we'll redirect that into a file called joined.csv. We can now see we've got the original file, sheet one, sheet two, and joined. So if we have a look at CSV, the joined file csv the look joined you'll see we've now um basically recreated the original file that we actually split up so we've got the title the year and the reason so what we did was we took the columns from this file and created two new spreadsheets and then rejoined them and again, basically, let's uh, briefly recap how we did that. Uh, first of all, we used the CSV look command to look at the table. We can then see um, all the data. We can then use the CSV cut command with the dash N option. And then that will show us the columns in the CSV file with a name. And then to extract particular columns, we used CSV cut with the dash C option and the um, number uh, of the column we want to extract. So again, one and two, and then we give it the file we're gonna work on. So this is gonna extract the first and second columns from this CSV file. And we, we redirect that into a new file. So one.csv. And to extract the third column, CSV cut dash C three worst films ever made two. So you can see here, this is basically the same as these two. So we've got number one and number two. CSV CSV look 
one. See the title in the year. GSV look two will give us the reason. And to basically join these together, all we did was CSV join one, two, we put that back to number three. And that has now created a new file called 3.csv. And we can look at that, 3.csv. And you can see it's joined this up perfectly. And we can also use the CSV cut command with the dash N option um, and the file name. And that will show us the, um, the column headers in the CSV file. So that's just a brief look at CSV cut and some of the things you can do that um, are actually a bit of a pain to do in a spreadsheet editor like um, Excel or Google Sheets, um, extracting um, a particular column um, from a spreadsheet um, in Google Sheets. I don't think, I think you actually have, to, I don't think there's a, a way you can actually, from Google Sheets, export only particular columns. Um, you actually have to create a new spreadsheet and use a formula to import particular columns from another spreadsheet. So this is a really quick way of extracting a, um, uh, a set of columns from a text file into a new file uh, and also rejoining them. So that's just a quick look at CSV kit and some of the things you might want to use it for. Um, and it's particularly useful, as I said, to extract um, columns into a new file or to reorder columns or to join um, a couple of CSV files into a new file.